I get to play the mini games again that I was so good at last time. Uh, I'm gonna play the mini games, but. <laughs> everyone welcome back to sally face last time i don't remember what we did i do remember i logged out too soon and there's a cutscene after uh so we're back in i didn't save and we get to do the end of that episode again we have to investigate bedroom 504 so that's where we're gonna go we're gonna do that and then we'll get the cutscene <laughs> I was just a little too quick. Oh, we need to get uh, uh, our thing out. This. Like. Oh, no, I don't want to play. R, right? No. Shift. There we go. Horses. Stacy? <laughs> so, are you okay? Dot dot dot. The dot dot dot. In the red. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, you know what? Maybe we missed the cutscene. Investigate. We have to investigate some more. I don't remember this part. In the bedroom, I was lost the file. Must have been in there for a while. Hmm. Okay, so we have to go to 504 bedroom. I thought we were. Are we not there? Yeah, we're there. Hmm. Just to double check. I totally remember. <laughs> I totally remember what we were doing. I logged out last time after we completed the things. And I was like, okay, this is a good place to stop. And then it kept playing before I hit stop. And it was like, oh, we're an adult talking to the therapist again. That's not what we wanted to do. Boy, can we go in here? There's a huge hole in the wall. Looks like there's room on the other side. Yes, 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 yes. Crawl through. Yes, put in a return. Yeah, but we returned, remember? <laughs> oh, we didn't see Stacy last time in the bed. We didn't see that last time. So that's cool that we missed that last time. I don't remember that last time. E Hello? Oh boy. I get to play the mini games again that I was so good at last time. Uh, I'm gonna play the mini games, but <laughs> we may edit this part out. Oh my goodness. Surely we'll be better this time. Sure. Uh -huh. Yeah. I retrieved the book of forgotten truths. Will you not see my worth now? Council recognizes the great resolve you shown us today. Let this book stand as testament of your place among our ranks from henceforth. May our sight pierce the heavens and reach the infinite and everlasting, for we are the devourers of God. Okay. Jim is impatient. Jim, we're so good at many games. Right? Uh, right. Easy. Easy. Please call me Greg. Greg. It's Greg. Uh. 
Okay, Rosenberg. I cut the power and Greg disposed of the bones. Good. And I destroyed the seventh book. We will really be able to stop them. We've got a good chance. Nothing is guaranteed, but I think we might have done it. Should have never let the let things get this far in the first place. I'm sorry that Luke had to get your family involved in all this. We can stop the ritual and the council won't have another chance to perform it for a thousand years. That's a long time. I pray to God that this works. God doesn't care about us, my dear. <laughs> hey, don't waste your breath on such things. We must fight for our own survival. Ow. Wow. I got one. Ugh. I should have gone down. I wonder, I'm not sure why we have like insta death spikes everywhere in here, but uh, that way the cult can thrive. Uh. Should have gone down over there. They're so tall. It looks like you're not going to fit, but yes. Oh, well, oh. zoom in. You are it was the voice telling Luke. It's not Luke, but Luke is do doing the things. Luke needs to, oh, dang. Oh. I mean, I wouldn't want to walk into the planes either. Luke, can you hear me? I don't think, I don't think so. I don't, I don't, I don't think Luke can hear you. Luke. Oh, uh, well, um, oh, Luke is the entity. Oh, that's okay. This is where we ended up, ended off last time. Um, and then this started playing after I logged out and I was like, oh, oh, there's more. <laughs> so <laughs> Now we pick up where we were. <laughs> what the hell just happened? Ty gave me one of his inventions. He said that theoretically it could overload and destroy an evil spirit. After I got it, I came upstairs right away to make sure you were okay. It's a good thing you did. So that red eye creep has been here for decades. That was before I was even born. I guess maybe I'm not cursed after all. Yeah, who knew Addison Apartments had such a dark past? But living here with Charlie was freaky. Dang, this is nuts, dude. Well, I don't think we'll have to worry about the demon showing up anymore. Todd's thingy seemed like it. Took care of it. No? What is it? No, that's just, that's great and all. I was just thinking, I guess, since there's no curse. This all means that my dad, he just, oh, in the fields, in the fields. Hugs, yes, hugs, hugs for Larry. <laughs> hugs for Larry, poor Larry. So this is the part here I missed, completely missed. Uh, but now this is where we'll pick up. <laughs> Sorry, Sal. That's our time for today. The guards are giving me the look. Wait, that was only part of the story. I'd hope to get some honest insight from you today, especially with this being our last session in your trial in just a few days. I swear in my life, I've told you nothing but the truth. Government conspiracies, demons, ghosts, and some kind of magical video game system. So, these things don't exist. You really can't expect me to believe you. Think about it from my perspective. The evidence against you for what you did. Well, it is profound. I know it's, I know how it sounds, but what I've told you is the truth. You gotta believe. Well, go to the tree house. Please just go and see for yourself. You'll find all the proof you need. Go to the tree house. What a psycho, huh? <laughs> I don't know. The doctor, is he, is he convinced? Is he going to go check out the story? <gasps> Perhaps. Heck yeah. Go see if it's true. You go see if this is a true story or not. Oh, wow. I guess it's been several years <laughs> since the last tenants have moved out. Sorry. Oh, boy. Oh, we're the... Okay. Now we're going to the treehouse. 
casual. We're gonna casually walk to the treehouse. Uh, at least the board stayed on. I was, I was wondering what they were gonna snap off. Box filled with clothes, books, cassettes, nothing of importance. Picture seems to be a photograph of Larry's parents. Nothing strange about it, though. Hmm. Rusty tools and other various junk. A few old amateur paintings. Probably Larry's. Hmm. There's absolutely nothing up here. I don't know what I was thinking. I guess I just needed to see for myself. So I was so convincing. And this whole thing has seemed... You think, Doc? You, you, th <laughs> you think just a smidge off? Maybe. Ah, and now, oh my goodness, Dr. Anon. Whoa, 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 what? Larry, no, don't freak me out. Don't freak out, man. We need your help. You have to get Sal out of jail. This she is, is much deeper than we thought, please. You have to get Sal here. The, this your, you can't be. Calm down, dude. You're going to give yourself a heart attack. This is important. If Sal doesn't get here soon, then... Oh. Oh. Shoot. <laughs> you just have a way with words, Larry. Just have a great way with words. <laughs> oh, I'm melting. I love how the animation of the ghosts appearing and disappearing. It is so good. And, oh, well, that's just not good at all. I, I mean, you might be able to walk that off. I don't know. <laughs> Have we finished episode two? Dang. I did not realize we were so close to finishing episode two. So now we're going to start episode three. Oh, yeah. This is the final episode. Episode three. I think there's only three episodes. I think. Is this real? Am I dreaming? White room, Anthony M. If what? Don't forget what I told you. Find me in the white room. Huh? Well, some of it was backwards. Some of it wasn't. Hello, who is this? Other, oh my goodness. No, no. <laughs> but you must not speak of this place to others. I don't know what those are. No. I got that part, but the other part I didn't get. I don't know what, I, I don't know those words. Oh man, something here is backwards. Here, Sal. Uh, safe here, use. Mm -hmm. So I'm guessing and safe here, Sal, is the four over there and then do not be afraid. You are safe here, Sal. Wow. Yeah. We're safe. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I'm the only one who uh, believed you is dead now. Well, that that is reassuring. What should I do? Are you in? Run. Run. What is that? Oh, this is nothing. We might not make it. Oh. Used to be a door here. Wow, what was the levers? What 
Oh, was I supposed to match the pattern, maybe? Yeah, I, I, I totally didn't do that. Is it true that you have chosen to forgo legal help in favor of representing yourself? Yes. I've got nothing to hide. Can you speak of your conviction of being an innocent man? Are you sticking with the story you've told the police? I will share the truth. Are you saying your original story wasn't true? I have no comment on that. Can you comment on the supposed person that allegedly killed your mother? How do you explain no witnesses or evidence of any such person? I don't see the relevance of that now. Is it true that they are going to add the Sanderson murder to your charges? <laughs> that would be news to me, but honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if they tried to pin that on me too. <laughs> what about Charlie Mansfield? I have nothing to say about him right now, except that I did what I thought was right at the time. Okay. Since we aren't getting any major details from you, let me ask you our highest polled question. The viewers are very interested in this one. Is it true that you are granted special meal privileges because you are afraid of baloney? I mean, baloney is a thing. I'm not afraid of lunch meat, okay? It's just, well, it's a long story. Your trial is still a few hours away. I think we have plenty of time. Ugh. All right. Are we going to hear why baloney is traumatizing? Oh my goodness. The baloney incident. <laughs> yes. I love it. Uh, Mr. Dude. Mr. Doodle. Mr. Doodle. I oh, got him. It took me a minute. What if I were more than just a doodle? What if you were? Talk. Hello. Are you okay? Uh, talk. Okay, you have nothing to say. All right, dot, dot, dot. Got it, just the dots. Thanks for the dots, bud. Appreciate it. What's wrong with your friend? He sought the truth and the truth destroyed his soul. Wow. wow. Now please leave us alone. Your head will frighten the children. <laughs> Can you tell me your friend ventured to find enlightenment? You travel to the wise prophet beyond the fields of death. But a round head like you will never make it. You silly round head. No way. Talk. Oh, hello. Are you okay? What happened to your limbs? Well, I never. How would you feel if I asked you what happened to your weirdly shaped head? <laughs> I didn't mean to offend. I was <laughs> bother someone else. Dang. Grumpy. Hello, miss. Don't pay any mind to my sister. She's been cranky lately because of the sun. It's no problem. Our ancestors were mauled by the great beast. Ever since our people are drawn without limbs. What sort of beast could do that? We do not speak of such things. <laughs> if you want to know more, you'll need to seek out the oracle beyond the fields of... De beyond the death fields. All right. Looks like we're going to the field of death or the death fields. Ah, uh, well, what is that? Hello? Are you the great beast? What? <laughs> How frick do you look to you, friend? Wow, dang. No, sorry, don't pay me any mind. My temper rises with the sun. Everybody's so hostile as a true doodle. The great beast hasn't been seen for over a hundred years. You know where the prophet is? You mean the crazy old hag who lives beyond death? Just take the ladder down. It's always a ladder down. Thanks, bud. Um, there's an eraser. Hello. You shouldn't have come here. Ah, where am I? A dark place. Is this the field of death? Horrible things happen when the sun burns out. Lots of dots. 
Okay. What is this? Oh. Ah, <laughs> you the prophet. No way. I'm called many names by the sticks. The little <laughs> thing we made back in school. I love it. Do you know about the great beast? It crawled through the great hole many years ago. It ravaged the sticks for decades, then was laid to rest by a magnificent explosion in the sky. Most believe the beast to be dead, though we know better than that. What is the great hole? Eons ago, we created a great hole in the papery fabric of this world. A hole that contains all the knowledge in the universe. How do I get there? What is the truth worth to you? Give me the dots. Everything. Whoa. I guess that was, was that the right answer. It was the right answer. It's the great hole. That silly roundhead just couldn't handle it. <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Fisher. So, wake up. Cool. That doesn't look like math to me. Sorry, I must have dozed off. I already finished the test. I know, dear. You aced it as well. Very good. Just try to stay awake for the remainder of class, okay? Sure. It won't happen again. Wow, this guy is just really not happy with me. And Mr. Phelps, eyes on your own paper. Yeah, Mr. Phelps. Travis, mind your business. <laughs> Class is almost over. Make sure everyone hands in their test before leaving. Mind your business there, bud. Man, you are so not happy right now. Hey, freak. Wow. Dang. Nobody likes a good two shoe Sally face. Nobody likes a cliche bully, Travis. <laughs> Tell himself. Did you have something better to do? Yeah. Shut up. Wow. Wasn't talking to you. Dang. You are angry, Travis. Maybe you need a Snickers. You know, if you took that stick out of your butt, you may actually enjoy yourself for once. Maybe even make a friend or two. <laughs> Frick off. I have more friends than you'll ever have. Dang! You kiss your daddy with a tongue out, sure. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I knew that was coming. That was a good one, Sally. You all right, Sal? I'm fine. Come on, let's report that jerk. No, don't worry about it. That'll just make things worse, trust me. I've dealt with bigger bullies than Travis before. Oh, poor Sally. You're bleeding. I'm okay, really. Here, let us use my bandana. Wait, hold on. I, you can't, I'm. There, looks like it was just a small scratch. Don't worry, you can hardly see it. Ha, huh, thanks, Ash. So Ash is super kind. Dude, what happened? The traps again? <laughs> I'm killing him. Larry. Larry, I'm fine. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Calm down, Larry. Calm down. Sounds right. We stir the pot. It could just make things worse. Not if he's dead. Calm, Larry, calm down. Then he'll probably just haunt the school and we'd be stuck with that bonehead for the next two years. <laughs> Says the group skeptic. <laughs> you know, I love you guys, but the ghost stories are a bit much, even for me. So really just going to let this Travis thing go. Is that worth it? Plus... Think about it. Who knows what his home life is like? He's got a lot of pent up rage. There must be a reason. Sally Face is so, so smart. I'm pretty sure he's just angry that they've switched bologna sandwich day to tomorrow. <laughs> Seriously, I've never seen anyone love the crappiest lunch day so much. 
It's like a prison meal and he doesn't even like pizza Fridays. Who doesn't like pizza? It's inhuman. <laughs> Maybe he's an alien. <laughs> Ah, that's all we need. All right, ghosts and aliens. Just Larry, I hope you could Travis when Sal isn't looking. Ah. I heard that. Ah. Those are good friends. Good friends. Next day, Bologna Day. Oh no. Good old Knockville High. Where the baloney is thick. Is that baloney smell funny to you guys? Oh, last, last week's was a little off putting, but it seems to be worse this week. I heard it was made from goat meat. Did a bunch of kids call in sick the day after baloney day last week too? Oh, hey you guys, don't ruin lunch for me, please. It's the only good part of the day. Goof huddle. I'm in. Me too. Got me in. Have fun. I'm gonna stay here with Chug. All right, Maple. Oof. We need to find out if there's anything wrong with this bologna. Maybe there was a batch of bad beef or it's expired or something. Or bad goats, I'm telling you, dude. <laughs> this stuff is funky. Doesn't taste like no beef to me. The product is most likely a blend of low-cost meat components from different sources of beef, pork, chicken, and or turkey. Thanks, Todd. Todd, man, you're making my stomach turn. <laughs> right? This is like the hot dog incident all over again. Uh, I hope not. Sal. So, might be onto something. There could be an issue with the lunch meat. I'd like to take our sandwiches to the science lab. See if I can find any bacteria signs of expiration. However, it would be helpful to know what the exact ingredients are. Okay, Ash, you go with Todd and help him in the lab. Larry and I will try to get more information on the blown. Sounds like a plan. Maple and Chug. Hi, Larry. Hi, Maple. Aren't you going to eat your lunch? Mom made me peanut butter and jelly again. I'm just kind of tired of it, you know? Uh, I mean, if you're not gonna, of course you can have it, Chug. Heck yeah. Travis. I thought I smelled trash. What are you? Wow. I hate Travis. <laughs> I thoroughly hate Travis. Get bent, Travis. Let's have some sandwiches to attend to. The luckiest baloney day. Well, yeah, you eat that baloney. Kim, oh, wait. Kim. Hi, Kim. We want to ask about the baloney. Can you tell us where the school buys it from? Why do you want to know about baloney, huh? Something wrong with Kim's cooking? No, no, no. We're just wondering where it. You kids go and sit back to chairs now. No more questions. I think we just see the package or no packages for you. Just butts and chairs. Go on. Oh, that didn't work. That was a failure, right? That's what I said. She always seems so unhappy. I wonder why she stays here. It's like the kids make her sick or something. Dude, what if Kim is poisoning the lunches? I don't know if this town has room for another conspiracy theory, though I guess it's worth looking into. Why don't you see if you can sneak into the principal's office to look at her files? While you do that, I'll check in with Todd. All right, I'll see what I can do. We need to go find Tom, right? And there's class there. Okay. Is this the science lab? I guess not. Odd. Strange. I, I missed. Oh, it was Mrs. Packerton. All two. Oh my goodness. Okay, so <laughs> we apparently have some exploring to do. Um, South. So my textbooks, Todd suggested I take physics this year, and I'm actually enjoying it. The world we live in is a fascinating, is fascinating and filled with mysteries. True. 
I've had this book pack, backpack since I was, I started going to school here. It's a little worn around the edges. Picture of us from Halloween. That was so fun. I'm lucky to have such great friends. You are. Locker. It's locked. If I had a paper clip, I could get in. Okay. Okay. All right. Cool, cool, cool. Bathrooms. Boys room. Cafeteria. All right, so, wow. The lock, the teachers are all in the lounge and waiting for the right moment to sneak by. Okay, so I guess we don't need to go this way. What's this say? I guess maybe we have to go down the other hallway to find, find time. I don't know where the... Uh, oh, help. I have to help Larry. We had to help. I, I had to go see Todd. Fine, we'll help Larry. Let's go out here. Window. The teachers are in there. I need to find a way to get their attention without them seeing me. Maybe if I make a loud enough noise. Hmm. Something to make noise. Oh, there's birds. I can't see them. They must be hiding. Let's see. Is there anything else out here? There's a ball. What am I supposed to do? I, I have a tennis ball. Okay, so I have a tennis ball. What can I do? I throw the ball to birds or something? Or do I not use the ball? Hmm. So I have to find something to make noise to get them to leave. Are they going to have me pull the fire alarm? Hey, what's wrong? The darn closet is locked. I need something in there to test the baloney. I tried to pick the lock like Larry showed me, but now my hairpin is stuck in the keyhole. It's jammed up good. Hmm. Use some pliers to get that out. But yeah, they'd be in the closet or with the canner, but he's always it was Lee's for lunch. Let's see what I can find. Thanks. In the meantime, I'm gonna keep trying to get this out. Alright. So everybody has their little tasks to do, it seems. There's a class there right now. Okay. Here's a client. Science lab. Let's check out the science lab. Find anything? Not yet. Were you able to get the baloney ingredients? No, not yet. No. Okay. Where's Ash? She went to get some materials for me. I recommended. She looked in the janitor's closet. Thought she'd be back by now, actually. No, oh, no. That's not what Be right back. Can't go past you. Baloney looks terrible. What's this? Ooh, sticky tack. All right. So we have a tennis ball and we have sticky tack. Not sure what we're going to do with those two items, but we have them. We have the item. That's what's important. So we have the item. Okay, so the science lab is down that way. Good to know. Good. So there's nothing in here, huh? Why, why am I allowed to go in here then? There's nothing at the desk. Ah, paper clip. Yes. Go help Ashley. Will the paper clip help Ashley? Is the thing. Let's see if we can pick these locks in the lockers first before we go back. Maybe we can find something there. Um, that is never sure as applies for his inventions. I don't know how he does half the things he does. The guy's a genius. The light thingy was a science experiment. Todd showed us in class. I'm surprised it's still going. Todd and his boyfriend, Neil. They're always so happy when they're together. That makes me happy too. Yay. Not much of a surprise that Todd's lockers have filled with books. I really admire his passion. Passionate curiosity, hunger for knowledge. Is that it?
Blair's backpack. We've been through so much over the last few years. He's more than my best friend. He's family now. I don't know what I'd do without him. There's stuff. He's so messy in a way. Sort of admire that carefree mindset. With my paintings, I was going to throw it out, but Larry insisted on keeping it. He said, great art doesn't need to be beautiful as long as it conveys genuine emotion. And I feel... <laughs> the poop out of this man i really do so supportive he does an older drawing that ash made she actually taught larry a lot of what he knows now she's a great teacher he may have never become close if it wasn't for larry oh, cool. okay so i can go to the bathroom Let's go back. Let's help Ash Let's see if we can do something. Maybe we can use a sticky tack to get the pin out for the shot. Awesome, it came out and I was able to get the door unlocked too. I must have been close to getting it open with the pin. All right, now that I've got what I need, time to head back to the old lab. Cool, I'll meet up with you and Todd in a little while. I have to figure out a way to get the ingredients first. We do, can we go in here? Oh, why can't we go in there and see what's in there? Mm. Okay. Where he shook the tree? Nothing there. Still can't see the birds. I'm not sure what the birds will do. Any luck? Teachers are on the lounge I'm waiting for the right moment to sneak by. Look. I'm not sure how to help Larry. Back into the cafeteria. Get out of boy, leave me in peace. All right. What do you want? Not, not you, bud. You're just not a nice person. How's the detective work going? Not great so far, but we're looking into it. You guys are wasting your time on this one. I'm telling you, this is a good bologna. Nothing wrong with it. Everything tastes good to you, buddy. <laughs> she has a point there, Chuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In any event, hope you're right. Okay, so we need to find uh, something, somehow, some way to get the teacher's attention. And I am kind of lost. This is where we found a paper. Nothing else in here. Uh, final exam is 523. Seven. 445. 16 over 3. One. I didn't see anywhere for a code, though. You know, like to enter a code or anything. And I can only open like mine, right? There's no other lockers. Just ours. What I'm seeing. At the grates. I could go in here, but why? Why was I able to go in here? What can I do in here?
Hmm. I am stuck here. I'm guessing the ball can do something, but I don't know what the ball can do. I'm like, can I plug the toilet with the ball? Normal, te normal tennis ball found in the courtyard. Right. So what can I do with it? Right. Nothing. Okay. So go back. I mean, is there a missing persons football tryouts talent show? Who tries to go? Knockfell pep rally. You celebrate your spirit. Yeah, but I don't. I'm not sure what to do. If I hit shift, is it? What if I push shift over here? That's how we activated the uh, Game Boy thing. They'll seem to be hiding. Hmm. Well, well, how do you think we should get them out? Is the question. We must have, we must have missed something. I don't know what we missed, but we must have missed something. I'm surprised that closet is no longer unlocked. Is the class in there now? anything not yet were you able to get the blue ingredients no not yet um look you're both here there's nothing you can do for me that's not what i wanted to do well i mean nothing in here Okay, I am stuck. I don't know what to do. How to get the teachers out of the Out of the lounge. Hmm. I do not know. Usually, they need to find a way to get their attention without them seeing me. Maybe if I make a loud enough noise. Yeah, how do you make a loud enough noise, though? I'm assuming with the birds, because nothing else, like, there's nothing else that I'm seeing. And it happened before where it was like, you just need to click space bar more often <laughs> there's something you're just not seeing they're not okay lockers there's nothing we determined A certain way to open the lockers. Oh, that could just be a coincidence. That 3.14 is in square up there at the top. Hmm. I don't know. I'm not sure. Science lab. We can go in the science lab. The class there right now. 
like the the red alarm like at the top that i like want to find a fire alarm and pull it and i'm not having any luck shift r q just won't we can use this paper clip to get into my friend's lockers but it's not your friend's lockers aren't helping you <laughs> there's nothing in your friend's locker we couldn't even take anything is the thing Very weird. Very, very strange. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm stumped. I am stumped. We got a table. There's no way to activate a fire alarm. There's no way to... Like, it won't let me throw the ball at the birds or anything. I don't see any seeds or... Maybe can I get food from someone? But I talk to everybody. Get the birds to come down. Nobody was offering any snacks to me. Going, squeeze into it. Time is point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, nothing. You want? That'll leave you peace. Just, I just need to get back there to do. Something. Weird, very weird, very weird. Hmm. The only thing that so the birds we have the birds in the tree and we have the lock. In the bathroom, like we can go in the bathroom, but there's nothing in here. I thought maybe I could put a, a the the tennis ball like in the toilet and flush it to make it overflow. But it's not like you can't do anything. So. Help, Larry. It's easier said than done. Hmm. Very weird. So there's something to do with the lockers or the bathroom. And I don't know what it is. Um, we're gonna have to find out what we can do. I'm kind of stuck here. I'm not really sure what the deal is as far as these guys. Hmm. Voice room, cruise room, better not. Okay, lockers. All right, what do we got? We have drawings, we have a backpack, we have pens and pencils, generic, generic textbook, a mirror, a paint, hand draw, a picture. Oh, you can go to all of them from there. I wasn't here yet. Ashley makes these stuffed dolls. I think they're cool. She calls them little dudes. Art supplies. Ashley and Larry are such good artists. They tried to teach me, but I'll never be as good as they are. It's okay. I have fun painting and drawing with them. They never make me feel bad for not being good at it. Oh, that's nice. Well, it's me. I didn't know she had this in her locker. Ah. Those type of pictures with it just coming handy. I'm sure she won't mind if I borrow it. Yes, progress. I knew that's where it was. I was just building suspense. Ah. 
It's just building the suspense. Um, okay, look, you're just a ray of sunshine. I love chat. I love our little chats. They're amazing. They must be hiding. They must be. Use. I guess I have to look for the birds, maybe. What is that gonna do? Help Larry. What I took of the bird from the courtyard. What? That doesn't help even a little bit. I thought we were going to make progress. How are you going to make noise? Hey, luck. Go in the lounge, wait for it. Home sneak by. Hmm. We have a picture of a bird. That's cool. I wonder what the point of this. Is. All right, last thing. Try taking a picture of somebody. somebody. Um. We don't want nothing with you, bud. Uh, do you want the picture? What if we, what if we gave you the picture? Would that make you happy? Nope. We see a picture of you? No. Nope. Hmm. Yes. Who else can we do? Um, we found the picture, the camera, so we can go. Is there something we can take a picture of in here? I don't know what that would be. Take these items back to um, Todd and see what Todd has to say about the camera pictures, maybe. Yeah, nothing. I thought we had a ma a massive breakthrough there. We did not. We absolutely did not have a breakthrough. No. I thought we did something. I thought we had done something and we did not do something. Oh, we were just in here. I don't want to go back in here. You know, you never know. Okay, 
Look, we, we have to do something. Because nothing is worth it. You know what I mean? Nothing. Nothing is worth it. Maybe there's something in the tree besides the birds? I doubt it. That's about all I got left. I got nothing else. Oh, that, oh we can't take any more pictures. Oh, okay. Well, that's... Not good. What was that? I don't know. It sounded like it came from outside. I don't see anything. <laughs> Neither do I. Maybe it was those birds again. Oh my goodness. The whole time. I had the ball. I had the ball. Did you get past? Yep. Good thing with that. Good thinking with that distraction, dude. I saw her file. Awesome. Anything to help us? Well, I had to book it so I didn't get a good look, really. If you can distract the teachers again, maybe I can just take the file? No, we don't want to draw attention to ourselves by stealing the file. All right, you're the boss, Sally. So what should we do? Give me a minute. I'll think of something. All right, so Sally's going to think of something. I don't know what we're going to think about. I have no idea. Help Larry. I have to help Larry again. Here, use Ash's camera to take a picture of the files. Great thinking, dude. Ready when you are. Okay. I mean, that's exactly what I did the whole time. Just keep throwing balls. I got good reflex. What was that? I don't know. Sound like it came from outside. I don't see anything. Neither do I. Maybe it was those birds again. I mean, why go look? Why go investigate? just the birds fine it's always just the birds. did you get it dude the file's missing how can that be no one else could have went in there without you seeing them <laughs> just drinking chain man i got the picture <laughs> what <laughs> score let's take a look good one larry good one kim yazzy uh position lunch lady previous employment amateur nature photographer notes kim has elephantitis it is not contagious and she is sensitive to it make sure the other teachers know tell kim to stop being the birds in the courtyard other teachers getting annoyed i think i know what to do meet you back in the left got it dude Larry's got that walk. Oh man, Larry didn't wait for it. Wow, I can't believe Larry didn't wait. Find anything? Not yet. Were you able to get bologna ingredients? Not yet. What? what? It said we. It said we'd meet here. You get that bologna yet, dude? Working on it. What? But it said. Get baloney from Kim. That's not what it said. It said we'd meet back in the science lab. It said we'd meet back in the science lab, not go see Kim. It's fine. It's fine. I don't mind seeing Kim, but that's not what we said we were going to do. I got something for you. What's this? A photograph of Birdie? You taking pictures, eh? Yeah, I took it for you. Just a small thanks for all the hard work you do. Your sweet boy, Sally. Thank you. I was wondering, can you tell me where the school buys the baloney from? Why are you so interested in the baloney? Oh, well, uh, my friends and I really like it and want to know where we can get some. It's local made by Mrs. Packerton. 100% beef. She brings from farm once a week. Here, I give you some extra meats for bringing Kim nice photograph. Yes. Thank you so much. 
Kiev. The science lab. <laughs> We're so smart. We got it. We got the things. We got the things in this stuff. Got more baloney. Perfect. You said it was made by Mrs. Packerton. Whoa, no way, dude. She lives in the apartment. So how can she make her own lunch meats? But yeah, I forgot she lives there. I hardly ever see her. I've probably seen her in a building twice since I moved here. She tends to return at late hours. I believe she keeps multiple jobs. Teachers don't get paid as well as you may think, so it's fairly calm. However, when Mrs. Packerton is home, she makes quite a lot of noise. It's very peculiar. So what do we do? Should we ask Packerton about this odd side business of hers, or are you boys going to do your whole detective? <laughs> I don't know. What do you think, Sal? Let's do a little snooping before we... Before going to Packerton, I don't like the way this is playing out. If something nefarious is going on. It'd be honest. It'd be best to not let Packerton know that we're looking into it. Yes, agreed. Good call, Sally. All right. Why don't you and Larry go check out Mrs. Packerton's classroom while the teachers are on break? Todd and I will finish testing this baloney. Exactly what I was thinking. Okay, we'll be back. Okay, I think this is going to be where we pause this playthrough. I don't, I mean, it could be the next five minutes is the end of it. I have no idea. Um, but this is going a little bit longer than normal, but that's because we had to replay the mini game at the beginning. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, this is so much fun. This, this game just keeps twisting and going in different directions. And some things are like super easy and I should know. It's just like, I didn't realize till I wandered around for an hour and it's fine. <laughs> it's totally fine. But if you enjoy, if you're enjoying it, uh, leave a like, leave a comment. If you know, you want to see more, let me know. If you have other games that you think might be fun to play, uh, let me know in the comments. I uh, really appreciate you hanging out and watching these. Thank you so, so much. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.